So we've all heard that saying, um, if it doesn't kill you, it will make you stronger. Like, I don't get that. Why would you wait for something to almost kill you to get stronger? It makes no sense at all. So, you know, I took that deep dive um, literally when I was told I was diagnosed and started to train like an Olympic athlete. And it was so funny because I asked a bunch of my doctors, you know, hey, I'm, I'm eating, you know, wheatgrass and kale and spinach and I'm working out like an Olympic athlete. And they just all laughed at me and said, this, you're wasting your time. And, uh -huh. you know, the surgery is going to be terrible and the radiation is going to destroy you. And yet, you know, that was 18, 19 years ago. And yet today we know that all that prehabilitative care can make a huge difference on your outcomes in terms of the quality of your life and, and you know, how well you cope and all that stuff. So I think for clinicians, they have to understand the patient's perspective mm -hmm. and any intervention that they're going to give after the surgery and the radiation, it, it'd probably be smart for patients to consider doing whatever exercises before they get hammered by the surgery, before they get hammered by the radiation. So at least they can master some of those skills. So if it's like the mobile T device, become familiar with it, understand how it, you know, it, it might be used, get used to it, practice it. So that way, if you, if you go through your surgery and then radiation, and, and now, you know, the quality of your, your ability has been, you know, compromised, at least when they introduce this tool, you go, oh yeah, I, I worked with this for five weeks or six weeks. Mm -hmm. So I think clinicians have to try really hard, you know, go the extra mile to convince patients that it's very, very necessary and beneficial that they get used to all these prehabilitative things so that if they do need to use them down the road, um, there's not a steep learning curve or the adaptation into their life is, is a lot easier.